We all know that plants move. They respond in those nature programs with clever camera photography. Um, they respond to all sorts of stimuluses from the sun changing um, to you know, the diurnal cycle. Um, and what we wanted to do though was speed that up to make it more meaningful for humans and actually make the plants move at a human speed. Each of the elements of the garden, the three key focal points, actually res responds and reacts to your movement. So as you pass through the entry in the tunnel, you can see the garden makes way for you to welcome you into the space. You then approach the green mirror, where you can see the garden then reacts to your body as you move forward and further away. It's exploring you, it's trying to understand who you are as you understand who it is as well. And then finally, the other big pillar of the garden is the dancing tree which reacts to you as you move from left to right. Do you remember those uh, dancing desk toy uh, sunflower plants you had in the 90s? What we wanted to do is see if we could actually do that in real life with real plants. For me, there's been a lot of innovation in the world of uh, plants with you know, creating new varietals, um, creating um, you know, ever more exotic and wondrous things to eat and drink. But um, I think there's a lot more that can be done in the world of floristry and, and, and plants for aesthetics. What we're hoping is this forms part of an ongoing project to really see how we can push um, the realms of floristry and, and the natural world, ultimately to give people amazing experiences.